Ziggy Piggy's back! Bitches just don't know. Bitches just don't know. Trying to fuck with the Lord of War. Bitches just don't know. Trying to fuck with the Lord of War. Bitches just don't know. Trying to fuck with the Lord of War. Bitches just don't know. Bitches just don't know. Give me my bonus soul. know what you're talking about.
I need those, that money. I really do. I need that money. Pay my bills. hands and knees and say thank you and still be on camera, I would do it. Phil, you know, we contribute to you, but it always seems like it's a black hole because it always seems like no matter how much we contribute, you're always still having problems. You're always still in debt and, and nothing's getting better. I agree with you. Oh, here we go. Now he's talking about WWE champions. So he's a piece of shit. You piece of donkey shit. How about this? How about this? WWE Champions, all right? WWE Champions lives rent-free in your motherfucking head. I don't think about WWE Champions. You do. You probably know way more about the fucking game than I ever will, because you're an idiot. You're an obsessed loser.
We have a number of lovely uninhabited islands in the northern hemisphere to choose from. Good! Can I go there in real life right now to be away from the fucking coronavirus? Okay. Fair enough. Alright. Ziggy Piggy's back! My laugh sounds like app, app, nap. So when I laugh, I go, <laughs> or, lobby, you finally get into one. People start quitting, like, dropping, ack, and the ack, trolls ack, come ack, in. Ack. No, and you just have to keep quitting like and quitting and going around in a circle. It's not fun. And then I switched over from PlayStation to Xbox last week, and we couldn't even find a single functional lobby on Xbox last week. So we ended up doing ranked matches for most of the night, and even that wasn't as consistent as it would uh, one would have liked. It was just very, very frustrating, and I hope that this week we get a better, uh, a better overall experience. It's not that there's not people playing; it's just that the way they made the game is so shitty that it, it really brings things down. You know what I mean? Um, <clears throat> so, ladies and gentlemen, as we're about to get started. With two hours of blah 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 I do my I absolute need that money. I really do. I need that to money to shout stuff out. Let you guys know, you know, answer your questions, give you credit for uh, contributions, and everything that I possibly can. But keep in mind, I am having to pay attention to the game pretty intensely. So please know, understand that and know that's why I can't be hyper focused necessarily on the stream chat the entire time that I play Street Fighter. But I do my best. Usually I answer questions. We have fun discussions. And it's usually a good time. Now, one thing that I do want to call attention to. We have goals set for levels of tips that are reached. At $50, I put on my gunner glasses. At $100, I put on a hat of your choice. And at $150, I put on a vest. Now, I always save this hat, the pilot hat, my last shot. for Friday night. It's the M. Bison hat. I wear it, I pick Bison, I go on a tear. The last two weeks that we played Street Fighter, we didn't reach this goal. And so we haven't seen M. Bison and Super Turbo in a while. All right? It absolutely would be great if we can hit this goal and see some M. Bison ass-kicking tonight. As soon as we reach the goal, I'm going to start picking M. Bison. 
and try to go on a tear like I have. Remember that one time I had like 30 wins or something like that? Or was it 40? I had a crazy amount of wins just with M. Bison, okay? So, let's see how it goes. Well, we see the dictator tonight, the Shadowloo, the Shadowloo leader kicking ass. We're, we're going to find out, all right? All right, as we begin here, shout outs. First of all, we start with Jax Raxer with a very generous $25 tip. Thank you, Jax. He says, good evening, Phil. How has the winter been going for you weather-wise in Washington? Uh, and then if Capcom announces Street Fighter VI this year, what characters would you like to return? What new fighting styles would you like to see for the new characters? Um, weather in Washington has been pretty good recently. After the cold, cold weather and snow that we had Christmas week, that was just the week right after Christmas, things went right back to normal out here, uh, which is typically around 40 to 45 degrees Fahrenheit. Now, shocks And you. a lot of cloudiness and rain. Every once in a while, we get a little bit of sun, but mostly rainy. Uh, that's pretty much our winter. I know that sounds weird. You're like, oh, winter's usually cold ice and snow, but it's not here. Usually, we just get a lot of moderate weather. The ice and snow we got the week after Christmas was actually abnormal for us to have. So, weather's been good. As for Street Fighter VI, I'd love for it to come out this year. I don't think it's going to, but I'd love for it to come out this year. Returning characters, here, here's the thing. I don't care who returns, but I want them to play like themselves. The problem with Street Fighter V is they had all these returning characters, and then they changed them all. Vega is now a, a motion character with dragon punch moves and stuff. Blanca plays absolutely nothing like any version of Blanca ever, and actually doesn't even have the properties of Blanca. No. I want to, the characters, if they're going to return, have them fight like themselves. Yeah, it doesn't have to be identical, but at least give me some reason to play the character, because there's some kind of semblance of who they used to be, not some ridiculous, newfangled remix. I mean, they might as well have called those characters anything else. They could have skinned them differently and looked different. It wouldn't matter. They don't play like their classic selves. You see what I'm saying? So honestly, I don't care if they bring back retro characters. I'd like if they have a few, but I don't care who it is as long as they play like the classics. Because that gives me a feeling of nostalgia, knowing I can play with a character from old school Street Fighter and actually a understand retard? a lot of the stuff of that ask. character because they've been in so many games before. You see? Okay. Um, and then Trill1817 has tipped me $10. That jumps us up to $35 in tips as we start. And that is great. Thank you, guys. Typically... What we've noticed with the Street Fighter streams is a lot of the, the content <laughs> oh my God, come I in early, which is actually good because they come in early and we earn perks. I the, the perks happen right away, you know, the Can rewards. I joking so that's good. Oh, my God. <laughs> ah. Ugh. Ugh. What the you know, the longer we have a hat or a vest, the better. <laughs> Finished up my coffee, which Ugh. is good. Now I'm going to get a nice energy boost. Hold up. It's going to clear up for the night. I like this guy. This, this new person came in, I think, uh, this morning. Jesus Christ. Doll seems elephants. That's his name. Ugh. And he constantly says, <laughs> Okay, he's actually starting to feel better now. The doll seem... Oh, I don't need this. I just turned on the, my Xbox Series X by accident. <laughs> Son of a bitch. I didn't mean to do that. Um, doll seems elephants from hyperfighting. Certainly don't need my Xbox on. All right. So let's get this plugged into here. Do you want to play the Here fucking game? Okay. Here we go. I know. You guys have barely seen me use uh, my PlayStation in, in many, many weeks. It's really only for Street Fighter right now that I'm using it. I mean, come next month, that'll be a little different because next month we're going to have Horizon Forbidden West on here. Um, and I'm probably playing King of Fighters on the PlayStation 5 as well. Most people have advised me they feel there'll be a much larger player base on PS5 compared to the Xbox Series X. So I'll be playing two games next month on the, the PlayStation, if you can believe it. <clears throat> Rugal Bernstein says, do you remember there was a user named Yoga Noogie on PlayStation? I think I do remember that from a while back. Yes, Yoga Noogie. Gotta love those themed names that are in line with what we're doing, right? God of War, of course, I'll be playing on on PlayStation 5. Of course, that's not out yet. That's, you know, much further down the line this year. All right, let's see. Well, I'm, I'm really dreading this, but I hope we can get some lobbies this week tonight. Let's see. <clears throat> okay. All right. Let's relax. Hopefully, hope for the best. <laughs> hope for the best after last week, man. All right, all right. Oh, yeah, 
that's right. His name was Joga Doogie. He didn't pick fucking Dalsim. He picked Balrog. I remember now. <laughs> now I definitely remember. Because I called him out. I was like, what are you doing? Dalsim's elephant is wondering if there's a chance of a Dalsim win streak. And then he said, Brrr. Uh, possibly. You know, I like Dalsim. I'm just, I'm not great with him. I wish I was better with Dalsim. I... I like to dabble with him, but I never really play enough with him to learn every matchup. And certain characters, are, the bully-style characters, the ones that can really stay on you and rush you down, those are the ones I have a lot of issues with keeping them off. So, Ranrod Reamer says, do I miss Penne Points? I do. Penne Points were great. Penne Points were an added fun social thing for my streams over on Twitch where people were able to wager these points they earned just by watching, right? So there was incentive to watch more because you would actually get more points to wager. And then... You know, it was really cool to be able to win or lose based on a guess or a gamble or a challenge or a dare, right? It was. It was neat. And now that's all gone. So not much you can do about that. Um, Quick reminder, everyone, for the 150 plus people who are here and climbing, if you like my weekly Street Fighter sessions, you want to see them continue, and you want maybe to get more attention on them, please give this stream a like. By giving this stream a like, it adds visibility to this stream and discoverability to this stream on YouTube. So when you're searching for all of the old school Street Fighter, my stream might pop up if you give this stream a like. So please remember to do so. The more likes, the better. Recently, I've been trying to get at least 100 likes on every stream, and I feel it's actually been helping for discoverability purposes. So thank you. Uh, Trill1 did another $4.20 tip and says, What are your thoughts regarding V-Trigger and V-Shift? Does it take away from the fundamentals of the game in general in your opinion? I can only answer you from my perspective of playing the older version of Street Fighter V because, uh, what happened here? Oh, okay. Still playing. Because remember, I didn't play the later versions. I only played, like, the first two years. And I would say, no, you know, V-Trigger, V-Skill, pretty much is kind of similar to having different supers you can select and say Street Fighter uh, 3 or Street Fighter Alpha, you pick a different ism and it gives you a different, uh, you know, ability. It's fine, as long as it's balanced and that's the thing. If there was one character who had a particular V-Trigger or, or, you know, a finishing move or, or, or super, it was so ridiculously overpowered, then that's not fair, but I don't know necessarily that that's the case. Maybe I'm wrong, because again, I didn't play the later versions of Street Fighter V. So. Okay, here we go. Alright guys, so welcome to my weekly late night Street Fighter session, also called Friday Night Fights. How's everyone doing? I hope you guys are ready for a nice weekly session YouTube of Street Fighter mode on. You know what? We have someone in the stream tonight who's called Dalsim's Elephants. They actually picked that name. I then want to start off tonight selecting Dalsim and see how I can do with Dalsim to start. Here we go. Yeah, I fucked up. It's a mid-range fight. I have to stay under the sonic booms with punches and slide as well, and I wasn't doing it. See? That was a good move. I missed, and now I'm fucked. Yup, punch right under that shit. Look at that. That's how you play that match. What, what do shit. I do? Nice move. Wow, it was so close. I was really hoping he would do that, too. I was really hoping he would do that. What a close-ass first match tonight. Woo! 
That was a good one. Thank you very much. I think Dalsim's Elephants actually did a super chat during that fight. <laughs> Damn. That was a good starter for sure. All right. Almost a perfect and traded the last hit. Still amazing. Lock him down. We're soulmates. Locked down in the corner. Couldn't get out. Very nice. Very good, very good. I know. Rugal Burns is the damn it, the perfect. I need one stinking hit to get the perfect. $16.51 from PayPal. He went to Ryu. Okay. Jamaica Mom. Yo, he got ridiculously lucky multiple times in that round. Right. Sure, you can the hand. He's just guessing. Oh, come on. Now where's the lag coming from? Come on. Yo, there's nothing I can do. It's lagging like crazy. This is miserable. I didn't do Yoga Flame, I did Yoga Fire. That sucks. I, I definitely lost that round. The first round I lost because he was doing crazy lucky shit. Just random reversals. The second round I lose because the fucking lag got so bad I couldn't do anything about his random moves. So stupid. Alright, so Chicken Man took me $1.50. He says, Activision Blizzard CEO Bobby Kodak reportedly turned up late and left early from the fireside chat meeting that was meant to reassure employees of Activision Blizzard about the future according to the Washington Post. What an idiot. Okay. I don't really care about Bobby Kotick at this point. I don't think anyone does. We don't want him to fuck out, and we know he's an asshole. Right? Blah, 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 also, let's get Dawson Blah, 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 yeah, he got pretty lucky with Ryu. <clears throat> thank you for the first super chat of the night. And then also thank you. Whoops, now I deleted letters. Shit. Thank you very much to Clay JT, who has re upped their membership for a second month. Let's hope everything is going great on this Friday night. Thank you, Clay JT. All right. Also. Trill did another $4.20 tip and says, this may be a dumb question. How does someone stream snipe in a fighter like Street Fighter outside of locking the game up or a glitch of some kind? I never understood when streamer claims to be stream sniped when they lose in matches. In this game, the game is a glitch. What happens is, let's say you saw that Jose guy, right? So he joins the lobby and he figured out a way to make it so that the lobby cannot start a match. It'll be his turn and he'll ready up so he'll force the game and to play, but then when he goes to play, it glitches and it goes back to the screen. Then he starts again, glitches, goes back to the screen, and it never works. You can't kick him. You can't do anything about it. You can't block him. There's absolutely no way in this collection to take action against it. He found a glitch that locks the, the game up online, and you can't play the game. So he does this all night. He follows me around everywhere I go and just kills that lobby. It's really messed up. Now, when you're saying someone's stream sniping, what I'm assuming that means... Hold on. What I'm assuming that means is that... There's someone who's maybe watching you play 
so maybe they're watching your stream. Let's say, for example, I said, oh, I'm going to play with Dalsim all night or whatever, right? So maybe there's someone who really comes and says, oh, I'm going to ruin that for Phil. I'm going to pick all the characters that are really hard to beat with Dalsim. Like, I'm going to pick fucking, I don't know, Honda. I'm going to pick Balrog. I'm just going to purposely pick these crazy, you know, characters that are way good against Dalsim and ruin his night because I know he said he was going to pick Dalsim all night. So why not make it torturous for him or something like that? That's what I would think. Um, the other thing you could do is counter pick deliberately like for example in tournaments this is banned but what happens is you wait for your opponent to pick their player and then you immediately pick a character you know is strong against them so that's called counter picking and in tournaments what they do is they do a system called double blind pick to avoid that from happening one person will predetermine who they're going to use like let's say i was going to use ken i would tell the tournament judge i'm going to pick ken but i won't tell it publicly i'll tell him like in his ear like a whisper i'm going to pick ken and then he'll say okay your opponent has to pick this character he will have no idea who I can pick the judge I'm going to pick. So he needs to pick character, and then I have to pick Ken. So character selection is completely separate from knowing who you're going to pick. So you won't counterpick a better character in that matchup, you see. It's really good for tournament play, but it means you're basically playing your best, and if you're genuinely winning the match, it's going to be why I want to select the screen. So one character is so much better than the other in the match. You see? So I love double play. Like, I always do double play. <sighs> Pinocchio says, what fighting game takes the most skill? That's, that's very, very, very subjective. You'll have different people say different things. I would always say I felt that it was Virtua Fighter and Guilty Gear were the two that took the most. And I would say just under that Tekken. But a lot of people might disagree with me. I don't know, but that, that's my take. Okay? Jade says he doesn't care whose backstories I choose. Well, why don't you just pick a couple characters again and toss them out, and I'll see if I know their backstories, because I might or might not. Uh, only Fear of Destiny, you ever see effective trap teams in Marvel 2, like Duck Doe Spiral Team during your active competitive days? Yeah, dude, I was there. I was there the entire time. I saw all those top-level matches. I was at Evo. I was at all the majors. I saw all that shit in person. I played against Duck Doe. He trapped my ass. Yeah, I've seen all of that. I was there. I was there for the height of Marvel vs. Capcom, too. Bro, no, how it says I was dinner. It was good. We have uh, pasta with a spicy marinara sauce. It had uh, pe some pepper flavor to it. It was really, really good, actually. All right, more Super Turbo. All right, I went did. Oh, God, listen to the lag. Ooh, that does not sound good. Wait, it might be, it might be steadying now. I don't hear it anymore. Okay. Now I'll go with Cam. He didn't want that. Oh my god. Wake up super. <laughs> Every move I went to do, he randomly blew through. Wow. I couldn't block. Wow. The connection is terrible. Yeah, he's getting away with all this stuff. I can't stop it. Look at that. Do you see that lag? Wow, it's so bad. It's so hard to win when lag's that bad. It's super duper hard to win. That was terrible. I'm not doing that. I'm doing the fucking flip. It didn't come out. I can't block. Oh my god. I can't block. Dude, it's so laggy. I can't block a fireball. This is so bad. There's no way to win this when it's this bad, man. No fucking... What the... <laughs> Dude, the lag is so bad. It was ridiculous. He got away with everything. He just full super. I can't do anything about it. I can't punish it. Because the lag is so bad against this motherfucker. I seriously... I don't even want to rematch him. He does random super. I can't punish it because the lag is so bad. I can't kick it. So, fuck it. I'll just go to a different lobby. Terrible. That was absolutely god-awful. 
He's like, I'm gonna throw fireballs. Okay, let me jump over it. Jump doesn't come out. Okay, I'll block it. Block doesn't come out fast enough to block the fireball. Okay, I'll do the roll over. So I do it and I kick, kick. The kick doesn't come out after the roll. So I, like, nothing I do ha works. It's all monster delay. Yeah, here's here's him walking up. Show you can, show you can, show you can, mash kick. Show you can, show you can. <laughs> like, it's a terrible play of people online with their garbage connections and they just fucking. They act like dicks, you know? That guy doesn't fucking know nothing. He sucks. Are you fucking gonna just complain all night? Just leave then. Jesus. All right. I'm calming down now. No, Cat is home today, Jones. No no overtime tonight. Cat is actually home tonight. So I'll be ending at the regular time. So thank you guys so far. Uh, thank you to Doll Seems Elephants for the first super chat of the night. Thank you to Jax Raxer for the current top tip of $25. We're at $44 in tips. Hint, $6 hint, hint. away from the tier one reward. Gunner glasses. But again, guys, I'd really like to hit the goal tonight of $100 to get the M. Bison hat and play M. Bison. I haven't played with him in like three weeks to a month. I would really like to do that. So if you like the Street Fighter streams, by all means, please support them if you can. And please tip me tonight. Also, if you're watching this live right now, we have about another 50 to 60 people since I said this earlier. Please give the stream a like. Like I need the like that money. I really do. I need that money. People can find bills. the fact that I'm playing this once a week. And I would love for more people to join us for classic uh, Street Fighter. So please give it a like if you're enjoying the stream. And also, of course, if you're watching this on demand on YouTube, give the video a like if you like it, and even leave a comment. All right, Jason, Goken and Buki and Poison. Well, Goken is the master of Ryu and Ken. And also, is he the brother of Akuma? I always get it confused if he's supposed to be the brother of Akuma or... Because I know... I think Akuma was either related or training. I don't have money to do it. 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 Wukong Karate, the power of the Hado with the fireballs and everything. You also can be overcome by, like, the dark side. It's kind of like a Star Wars story. You can be overcome by the dark side of the force and become evil, and that's what happened with Goku with Akuma. But anyway, Goku is their master, and he trained them both. Um, and, uh... And then uh, he comes back as Street Fighter. Uh, inexplicably, he survived, and somehow he's back in Street Fighter 4, despite the fact that he supposedly was dead for like the longest time. I don't know. They rewrote the plot. Um, as for Ibuki, she's supposedly just supposed to be a ninja from a small village in Japan, and that's really her story. Like, she doesn't have much to it. Um, she's one of the, the variety of cast that was added to the Street Fighter 3 uh, lineup at, for new characters. They were trying to make a whole new lineup of characters for Street Fighter 3. I think she's pretty damn unique with the way that she, she fights, too. Um, and then, what was the third one that he said? Woo! I'm Poison. Oh, Poison is part of the Mad Gear Gang, along with Hugo slash Andor, who are supposed to be the same person. Um, and basically, she she's like the the, the assistant Oh, here we go. Now he's talking about At one point, he was a pro wrestler, and she was like his manager. But then he went and actually joined the Mad Gear Gang, and therefore she joined the gang with him. Now, there's a lot of other stuff I can tell you about Poison, but, all right. I don't know how appropriate it is. Uh, let's see here. Your motherfucking head. I don't think about WWE title slot. You do. You probably know way more about the fucking game than I do. Notice everyone picks Sean online. You're an idiot. sucks ass offline. I do some online. Lose that. I love it. Go. This guy got the shit juggled out of me. <laughs> Are you ready? Go. Uh, no super cancel, of course. How do burst of the ball? I parried that. Didn't come out, of course. One hit. Get me out of the corner, though. Look at that trade. Money Creature tip four dollars says this is for four cans of Fancy Feast for Jasper. Jasper does not like Fancy Feast, actually. We get him a nice drop a dry food that he absolutely loves. And it's actually very high protein and almost no kind of fillers or anything like that. But he will appreciate it. Thank you very much to Money Creature for the tip. Okay, let's see. I want fuck this. I'm picking fucking Cammy again. That last match was so laggy. That was not representative of me playing Cammy, and I want to pick her again.
That was not the rush kick. My two rush kick will knock him out now. I can't get thrust kick once. Not once did I get thrust kick. I love it. <sighs> I can't even block the fucking wall dive. There we go. My moves fucking come out. I win. So of course someone drops, that means the lobby will fill up with the troll and I have to leave. Which sucks. It means I can't stay for more than like a few minutes in any given lobby because this game is a piece of shit. <laughs> it really is. It's a broken piece of garbage. They really should have fixed it and patched it over the years. They just didn't care. Shit. <laughs> Rush kick. They said, Phil, you know, we contribute to you, but it always seems like it's a well, I still can't get it. Because it always seems I get, like no matter dude, how I don't get it. You're always still in debt. Times. You're always still in debt, and, and nothing's getting better. I agree with you. Oh my god. So stupid. Thank you, Twisted Resistor, for a super chat. If you had to pick one fighter to play as forever, who would it be? Oh my god. I'd have to think about it. That was thrust kick. That was thrust kick. Ah, huh. the vacuum grab! The vacuum grab. So good. So, yeah, I mean, the thing is, you would probably want a well rounded character. A character that could do well in many different situations. As opposed to a character who's like a one-trick pony and then sucks it all against other characters, right? The other problem is you can't... I can't answer that because not every character is in every fighting game. You know what I'm saying? Like, you say, oh, who's your favorite Street Fighter character you play in every game? Well, what, what the fuck? You know, Balrog's not in every Street Fighter game. He's not in this one. So I can't even say that. <laughs> How do you do it through PayPal? Type exclamation point tip into the stream chat. You'll get the link. Thank you for asking. Sit the fuck down. That was a good parry. Right. Ass! Ass! Dude, he's getting his shit, the shit crushed out of him by a giant flying ass. That You know how stinky that ass is? Hugo doesn't wash that often, man. <laughs> we all know this. You go barely wash it. Oh, you fucker. He's fooling me. Well, I can't parry online, so fuck it. Final round. Go. I can't. I can't do it online. Forget it. No point. Just sucks because what it is is when you're doing a mid range game against Ryu, you need to parry everything. You do. You need to parry high low. And I can't parry anything in this game online. It just doesn't work. You can't. You try. Okay, here it comes. It's going to hit me high, so I parry forward. Oh, no. You, you didn't time it right. Yes, I did. Your fucking net code sucks. I timed the parry right. And you just can't play the game. It sucks like that. So a, a basic high-low game with Ryu against certain characters will dominate in third strike online. There's nothing you can do about it. You can't parry in time to stop it. It's ridiculous. Oh, let's see here. So Twisted Resistor, the Super Chat, who's your favorite character? Balrog. All, overall, in all of Street Fighter, probably Zhang Yi. 
I think Zangief's probably my best, uh, or my favorite character because his grapples, but also in certain games, he's actually been a good combo character. Yeah, probably Geef. The villain did a $5 super chat and says, Ryu is a well-rounded character, but I feel Ken is better in terms of damage, but I could be mistaken. In general, that is correct. Usually, Ken has better combo ability than Ryu in most games. And also, Ken usually has better throws. Especially Super Turbo, he has the knee multi-hit throw that can be linked into other setups and mix-ups. Um, but Ryu has better controllable fireball speed, meaning his fireballs usually because of their, ti their timing and speed, and, this, and uh, not only the speed they go across the screen, but the, how fast they can come out when he does the motion. Usually he's better for zoning, so he can lock down people with fireballs a lot better than Ken usually can. So there have been some games where Ryu's better, and there's been some games where Ken's better. Jesus, why do I like Urien so much? Blah, 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 I don't know, like, blah, blah, the thing blah, is blah, Urien, blah, I don't play him like blah, 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 My Urien blah, gameplay blah, is pretty much self created blah, 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 I didn't copy blah, blah, anyone else when I picked him and started playing with him. I just kind of messed around until I figured out something that works. While everyone else kind of plays a pattern with him. Oh, the same, t uh, we're going to use the, the, uh, Aegis Reflector Super. I'm going to do the, the mix-up in the corner where I throw the super out. I don't know how to block and I hit you high-low, high-low. I don't do that shit. I always do something more different and varied because I'm, I'm kind of... Honestly, I, I really don't try to copy other people. I try to do my own thing. I'm going to try Fei Long. Probably going to pay for it. <laughs> but in reality, the real reason I like Yuri is because he's wearing a Speedo. Come on. Name another fighting game character wearing a fucking Speedo. And by the way, I did first I did Reversal Flame Kick when he jumped, didn't come out. Then I did Super, didn't come out. Right through his fucking fireball, and then it didn't work. He got so lucky. Yes, the full Rekkas, baby. The full Rekkas. I love that shit. So this lobby's good, but it's only two people. The game glitched, so now no one else can join the lobby. <laughs> Funny how this fucking happens. Dial seems elephant said, a fighting game isn't complete without an obvious Bruce Lee tribute character. Do I agree? <laughs> Uh, not every fighting game has one. Tekken does, and obviously this this game does. But uh, not every fighting game does. It's nice when they have it though. Right. Wow, that was lucky. I should not have won that. Headbutt. Ass! Oh, he kicked it. Yes! I guessed he would do that. Very nice. Very good. So I got my revenge on him. Good shit. Oy, oy, oy. Let's see. Who did I do uh, last? Fate Long, right? And I beat his ass. Uh, Alright, speak of the devil. I haven't picked any grappler tonight. We'll go with Zangief. Zangief against Vega. Delightful match.
take that trade any day. Very nice. Joey the Kobold asks, what characters do I want to bring back to Street Fighter 6 that weren't in Street Fighter 5 as DLC? I don't even know because I don't know the cast. I'm serious. I don't know the cast of Street Fighter 5. I didn't fucking play it after the second uh, season. I paid zero attention. I don't even know who's in it. I can't answer the question. What the fuck? The other dude picked Vega. Fine. I'll pick Zangief again. I'm playing, I'm playing an onslaught of Vegas with Zangief. Same stage? Squish it. Squish him. <laughs> wow. That was three. Our uh, spinning. Oh, there we go. Oh. I'm doing spinning clothes. It's not coming out ever. these guys one more two more times and I'm gonna leave it's been fun but I don't want to keep beating up on the same people all night so hello guts good evening good to see you <clears throat> oh oh you know what someone mentioned Ken how about Ken do some Ken Kniff from Connecticut tonight against Bison of course, Jade is interested in DJ Vega Ball of Blanca. All right, we shall see. He got away. <laughs> I don't think he meant to do that slide. It was a bad move. Is it crouching medium because he's standing? No fault for sure you're getting it all. Wow. The lag spikes are crazy. She's dropping my fucking inputs. I wanted super. Wow, couldn't do anything to the lag. Oh my god. Finally. Damn. <laughs> Couldn't even move. Alright, one more, then I'm out of this lobby. I'm bored of these guys now. Well, okay, Jade asked for Blanca. Let's get some Carrot Blanca. Actually, it's the wrong Blanca. That's not Carrot Blanca. That's Hyper Fighting Blanca. My fault. Get the wrong one. Yummy! Chicken Man did a super chat. It says, nice moist cake or a nice moist brownie. Actually, I would prefer a brownie. I would. I told you guys I'm a chocolate a chocolate-holic. Yummy! Whoa! Oh, my ball didn't come out! My ball! Woohoo! <laughs> I hit him. I can't believe that hit him. All right, I'm done with this lobby. I, I beat these guys up too much. I got to go play other people. All right, good matches to those guys. Good matches, but I need some variety. I can't be there all night w w wailing on those two dudes. All right. Try this one. 
All right, cool. Let's try this one. A nice moist gooey brownie. <laughs> Full of fudge. Mm. The more fudge, the better. <laughs> okay, then. Quick reminder, everyone, if you're enjoying yourselves tonight, please give the stream a like. It adds to the discoverability of the stream. I've been aiming to try to get about 100 PayPal. likes per stream moving forward this year. I think that's a good goal to have. If you're having a good time with the over 200 people that are here, please give the stream a like. And the same thing with those watching on demand. Please like the video and leave a comment. Uh, if you'd like to support the stream tonight, go, go, many go, ways you go, can go, do go. so, whether Fatty it's a membership, book. super chat, super sticker, or a tip. We're literally $2 away from the first gold tonight is the gunner glasses but i would really like to hit the hundred dollar goal and go crazy with bison tonight we have not seen m bison and the m bison hat and reward in many many weeks of street fighter so please guys if you could support the stream and thank you all right only fear of death asks uh is Shoto's the best beginner to play for someone getting into Street Fighter? If you pick a Shoto like Ken or Ryu, you will essentially learn a lot of basics about Street Fighter. You will. Now, I'm not saying that they're actually easy to play. In some of the games, they're actually some of the harder characters to play. But if you pick a Shoto, you'll learn fundamentals of keep away with fireballs. You'll learn fundamentals of footsies from mid-screen, anti-airs with the show you can. You'll learn a lot of things. Hell, even combo abilities. In some games, they have really good combos. Guts, the Black Swordsman, is asking well, I'm going to do a poll for Sniper Elite 4 soon. So here's how it's going to work, okay? I know. Ah. Here's how it's going to work. Damn, he got fucked up. Tomorrow, I'm going to play Skyrim. Tomorrow night, it's going to be a Game Pass night, where two games that you guys are currently voting on right now on the main channel page of DSP Gaming will be played for about an hour each. We'll see which ones you guys like. Sunday, it's going to be more Skyrim paired with Halo Infinite. Then when I come back from my break on Tuesday, it's either going to be more Sniper Elite 4 or it's going to possibly be one of the games that you guys saw me play on Saturday night. All right, but we got to see what games I play Saturday night and if they're, they're basically playthrough worthy. We'll see. I'm going to go with uh, Hugo, although this is probably a really bad choice, especially with this laggy connection. Okay. Prepare to strike now. Oh my god, this connection real bad. I don't know why I'm trying to parry. It's so bad I can't do anything. I got him. Wow, I parried and got fucking reversal super. Boom. I can't believe I got it in this fucking lag. Good shit. That was lagtastic right there. It's over! Oh my god, destroyed him, even in the lag. Good shit. You win. Good Stop shit. It. Oh yeah! Third strike again. Three and a half weeks till King of Fighters 15, says Mark. So I'm excited, I'm going for Yuri Kill and Mai. I'm gonna play with everyone. I don't know if I'm gonna do good with everyone, but I'm gonna play with fucking everyone. Give it a shot. Oh, well, you wanna do Yurian, huh? I'll do Yurian. He goes, everyone picked Sean online, dude! Everyone picked Sean and has a laggy connection online in this fucking game. It's ridiculous. Are you ready? Go! That's bullshit. How the fucking basketball hit me in the face? Break the shin! 
Snap the shin. Very nice. Only Ice Infinite can be two dollars. Asking what's the best Dark Souls type game? Dark Souls. Dark Souls One is my favorite of all of them. Super! Wow! Reversal parry into full fucking super. A full sure you can't hit the face. That sucks. Uh oh. Oh my god, the lag couldn't get it. Full sure you can into the face again. He couldn't get over it. He couldn't get over the EX fireball. Wow. You win. So thank you, Only Iced Infinite, for that tip. With that, we have hit the tier one tips reward for tonight, which is the Gunner Glasses. Laugh, thank you for like that. Act, act, act. I beat that guy so go. badly he quit. He rage quit <laughs> out of the, the room. He's out of here now. Does that sound like act, 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 act? No. He's going to go cry like about how he can't win online with Sean and his laggy connection. Woo hoo. All right. Oh man, who to use? How about DJ? I got requested DJ. We'll go with DJ. Good evening, D-Man. How are you? Good to see you. Now we're working towards the hundred dollar goal and a bison win streak. See if we can make it happen, guys. Put him black. Wow! Three times I did a move, nothing happened. I didn't do that either. Yeah, dude, the game is actually literally dropping my inputs about half the time, and it fucking lagged like crazy about twice giant lag spikes. I can't block. I couldn't block. It's so bad. The lag is so bad in this match. It's fucking stupid, man. That was fucking maxed out. Didn't come out. Can't block. I can't block his jumping. Didn't. Why? Well, I can't get him maxed out. I can't get my moves. I can't. Dude, it's so bad. 90% of the time when I did a move, it gave me the wrong move. It was I was doing max out. It gave me down up. I'm doing fucking a normal move. It gives me a jumping move. That was insanely bad connection. Ridiculously bad. What the fuck? There's no way people say it was a legit fight. It was just random fucking lag. He just kept wall diving in the lag. What am I supposed to do when I can't even block or move around, right? That's fucking terrible. <clears throat> Jade is saying Tekken is his favorite fighting game series, the first one he ever played. Probably my, who, probably third favorite. Because I've definitely, Classic Street Fighter is my first, and then I would probably say the old school versus series, like, like X-Men vs. Street Fighter, Marvel vs. Capcom 1 and 2 is probably my second, and then I'd probably say, uh, Tekken is probably my third. I do like King of Fighters a lot, it's just that I never really played it competitively. I never actually, I only played it, like, three different versions at the local arcade, and it wasn't like it was a high-level of comp, you know what I'm saying? Like, it really wasn't a high level of comp to, for it, was just kind of people messing around with the game. <clears throat> oh my god, that was so, that really is ridiculously remarkable how people have figured out how to play online with the lag so bad. Like, Vega, so what did he do? Walk forward, poke a couple times, jump in, can't do anything, can't block the jump in, can't block the follow up. So he gets a jump kick and two low attacks. And it three hits, even though only two combo, the game gives him three hits. Doesn't even make sense. Like, I'm trying to block three hits, but only it's two combo. It's fault. Like, you got three free hits. Like, what is going on? And then mash, mash throw, can't stop it. Goes through everything in lag. This is bad. All right, shout out to Hiseo, who just tipped me twenty dollars. Thank you, Hiseo X4. He says, "So Phil, I would like to see some M Bison madness." Have you decided about what to play King of Fighters 15 on PS5 or Xbox? Most people are telling me to play it on, on PS5. Most people are saying they feel that the bigger player base will be on PS5. 
So I guess what we'll do is we'll start with PS5. We'll see how the game plays on there. You know, I obviously I want to have a good time with it. If I'm having a good time with it, I'm doing well. There's always a possibility I might actually get it on Xbox as well to have twice as much comp, you know? We'll see. The thing is, I know for a fact next month's going to be one of the most expensive gaming months ever with the amount of games I'm going to be getting. So I don't know if I'm going to be able to drop two copies of that like that. We'll see. And by the way, I should say to everyone, if you are thinking of possibly helping with the cost of the ridiculous amount of games I'm buying next month, which include Sifu, Horizon Forbidden West, Dying Light 2, King of Fighters 15, Elden Ring, and that's the top five off the top of my head, you could always get me some credits on like PlayStation Network or Xbox Live. All you got to do is buy those digital cards you can get right off of Amazon and then email me the code at darksidephilahotmail.com. People have done this over, over time and it helps me a lot. So please consider it. It's another way to contribute. If you don't really care about stream interaction or whatever, it's a great way to uh, help out. I will definitely need it next uh, next month. <clears throat> Apparently this is not working between these guys. Okay. So Jose joined. Yeah, the whole lobby just broke down. Everyone quit and then Jose joined the troll. Jose is the troll who ruins the lobby, by the way. Jose joined this one too. So here we go. It's breaking down now, guys. This is exactly what happened last week. If I can sneak into a room that's almost full, then maybe I can avoid the problems. So this resigned trolley was the guy I was playing earlier and beat his ass a bunch. But I didn't play these other guys, I don't think. Was I ever a fan of Mortal Kombat? Yes, I was. When I was growing up in the 90s, along with Street Fighter and arcades, Mortal Kombat was just as popular, if not more popular, many times because of the excessive gore that people really seemed to like. You know, oh, sex and gore sell in the 90s, right? Um, so I played them. I don't really feel that like they felt like good competitive games until Ultimate MK3. Like, before then, they were just too slow moving. There was no dash. There was no fast moving across the screen. And a lot of characters just didn't have the mobility to really avoid things that other characters could do. Like, seriously, like, Mortal Kombat 2, there's two playable characters in Mortal Kombat 2. Uh, Melina and Jax. That's it. Like, literally no other character in Mortal Kombat 2 can actually play competitively. Those two characters dominate everyone in the fucking game. They're just not, it's not a well-balanced franchise. Not until Ultimate MK3, uh, and then it got much better, much better balance, so. Okay. Good evening, Go Team Venture. How you doing? Good to see ya. What just fucking happened? It timed out, and then they got to play anyway. <laughs> All right. Jose OX says, here's a scary thought. What if Goody Tanks follows you around King of Fighters 15? I mean, he might, but I don't think it would be a big deal, honestly, because we're, we're on equal playing field. And plus, I, I have a background in King of Fighters, so I probably whoop his butt. Okay, I'm going to pick fucking DJ again, because again, that last match shouldn't even fucking count it. It was lag fucking city. So stupid. What's up, Grace? I'm a new subscriber from Rainbow Six Extraction. Welcome. So, great. if you're new, you might not know this, but I do Old School Street Fighter every single Friday night when I can. Um, because I used to play these games in arcades in the 90s, and I actually used to be a tournament level player in Old School Street. Ooh, in Old School Street Fighter. Oh, shit. Oh, my foot wasn't long enough. Yoink! He tried to walk up and do, like, a low attack, but it was too late, and I have good throw range. I said, toss. Block. I couldn't block it. I tried, didn't freaking work. Right. Oh my god. First of all, the lag, you can see the game freezing in the middle of the match, but on top of that, you see how much damage old Ken does? It's absolutely ridiculous compared to like a new character. He does like double damage and he barely hits you and he takes almost your full health bar. It's pretty ridiculous. Wow, that's not what I wanted. I wanted kicks to punish it. I need to do the max out. What? Oh my god, that sure you is ridiculous. What the? Wow! I did reversal. I did wake up reversal. The game doesn't give it to me. Gives him a two hit dizzy combo. So bad. <laughs> it's completely unearned. He's jumping at me. He's wide open. Here comes the reversal. I don't get my reversal. He gets jab sure you can, and it dizzies me. Because it's old Ken, and old Ken has really unbalanced mechanics. 
Unbelievable. Oh, instant rematch. Good. Good, because that was stupid bullshit. <laughs> Alright, fuck this guy. No, really, fuck this guy. I'm about to show him how fucking lucky he just got. Wow, nice max out. Shall cut artist marketing to avoid all coronavirus comments. I do that too, if you guys really want to. Completely destroy. Okay. Okay, perfect. There you go. That's my revenge on that fucking guy. Stupid bullshit. <laughs> that was a sufficient amount of revenge. The perfect was a sufficient amount. I'm pleased with the outcome. There you go. Oh, come on. Well, here we go again with this game bug bullshit. The game doesn't work. So now we can't play each other. And of course, watch this guy not back out. Instead, he'll just sit here and keep, keep uh, readying up. And if he does, it means that basically uh, we can't play. This is the glitch. This is the glitch that fucks the game up. Oh, my God. All right, dude, it's not going to fucking work. Really, really. Heisenberg for Prez, it ain't going to work. Your connection is never going to work. Just leave. Jay says that Mortal Kombat is his second favorite uh, fighting game. So first is Tekken, second te uh, Mortal Kombat. Gotcha. Yeah, unless he quits, I, we have to leave the lobby. I'm serious. He could just okay. He, he backed out. Good, because if he doesn't quit, there's no way he can stop that. They never programmed in a way to stop that in the fucking game. Dumb shit. All right, how about some T Hawk? I haven't picked any T Hawk this week. He's trying to pick Akuma. He got him. He picked fucking Akuma. You cheating piece of shit. Right. Yes, they said that you're a gay boy. That's right, you can't dizzy Akuma. We're I make forgot. Love to each other tonight. I forgot you can't dizzy Akuma. He gets out of it instantly. Oh my god, I'm so broken. Did I play Clay Fighter? Absolutely, I did go to Adventure. Fireball. Right. Nope. Take the chop. Right between the balls. Imagine that. Imagine T Hawk's ginormous club like hand forced to turn into a blade going between your balls and striking you right in the ball sack. Ow! Ow! Fuck! That's gotta hurt. By the way, this guy still hasn't figured out his connection doesn't work. He's still gonna sit in this lobby. James, I've played UFC games. I didn't never, never necessarily really liked any of them, but I've played some of them for YouTube. Yes. <laughs> Uh, Guts, doubtful I'll be playing any of the Splinter Cell games in downtime. Very doubtful, unless there's a reason to. No, Pinocchio, I never played Dive Kick. Nope. Not once. Okay. I'll do it again. 
He's going for Akuma again. He's fucking picking him again. Oh my god. I hope you get Ryu, you son of a bitch. I hope you get fucking Ryu. He got Ryu. That's what you fucking deserve. <laughs> That's what you deserve. Wow, the moves don't come out. The moves still don't come out. Oh my god, the connection is so fucking bad. I don't have Netflix, so I cannot watch Squid Game. Nope. Wow. It still hit me. <laughs> it should still hit me. That's amazing. I hit him with my dive and I landed. The fireball still fucking hits me after the fact. Holy shit, dude. Alright, I'm just gonna quit out of this lobby if these guys aren't gonna fucking play. Yeah, right. I've heard Squid Games is similar to Hunger Games or, or actually Hunger Games is based on Battle Royale. So it's basically Battle Royale, right? Guile. Right over the sonic boom, point blank. That was great. That was great. Shit. I knew it. Done. Grabbed him by his giant fucking... Flat top, slammed his fucking ass. <laughs> no, I do not negative edge that 360 throw burgle burn scene. It's just the regular motion and regular button input. No negative edging there. Go Team Venture took me five dollars. Says love me some Street Fighter. Thank you, Go Team Venture. I also love me some Street Fighter, and that's why I play it every week, every Friday night. Thank you for that contribution. We're twenty-five dollars away from the hat and M Bison and M Bison Street. Hopefully, I hope we can hit the goal this week because we not, did not hit it the past two weeks. It would be awesome if we did. Do I like... Oh, how do I like Rainbow Six? Am I going to play it again sometime? I really enjoyed it. Ask Greg. Uh, my opinion is done. It's a good game for co-op. If you have, like, two buddies you want to play it with, it's probably a really solid game. I had fun playing it the little bit that I did, but I don't really do co-op games. I only played it because uh, it was on Game Pass. It was a new release, something different to do. If people wanted to see me play it again, I would, but it definitely seemed like the consensus during the stream was like it was kind of a one-off just to kind of, let's see what it is, you know what I mean? It wasn't like, oh, please play it again. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, got him. But yeah, like, that's the good thing about Game Pass games like that is I could check it out. I enjoyed it. I didn't love it. I don't think I need to go back to it because I've kind of seen what the game has to offer. And it didn't seem like the viewing audience was too much into it, so there was no risk of me playing it because I didn't spend any money on it. That's what I like about Game Pass. It's very consumer-friendly in that way. Um, but I don't know if I'll be playing it again because, like I said, I'm not really a big co-op guy. And it really feels like you want a team of three people you know, you trust, to play that game. Just doing it with randoms online didn't seem very good, you know? <clears throat> well, at least the guy whose connection wasn't working left. That's good. Okay. Oh, hyper fighting. Here we go. In hyper fighting, I always pick Balrog. I don't know why. I, I used to like Zangief because he's really good in this one. I don't know. I just enjoy Balrog. He's low tier, by the way. Round one. Fight. Of course. Oh, of course. 
Oh, of course. Every button I press, I get counter hit because Ken is so good. And fucking Balrog's low tier. So just get away with that. Look, just get away with everything. L literally, I didn't have an opportunity to do a single move. I'm serious. That's how fucking unbalanced this game is. There was nothing I would have done that would have hit Ken. <laughs> nothing. Standing fierce punch and it stuffed me. Nice, I locked him in the corner. Beautiful. That was a good round. That was a good round right there. <clears throat> Alright. So, ladies and gentlemen, we are entering an hour two of tonight's Street Fighter uh, throwback stream Friday Night Fights. Thank you to everyone who's been chilling with me. Watching the stream, having a good time, contributing. If you're liking the stream, please give it a like on YouTube. Right now, we've got 51 likes. It would be great if we get 100 by the end of the stream. we got over 200 people on the stream. So please, if you like it, please give it an actual like. Okay? Same thing for people watching on demand as well. Please give it a like and leave a comment if you want to help out with the discoverability of the stream. We're only $25 away from hitting the hat goal and seeing M. Bison tonight. So please, tip if you like the stream. I'd love to do that first time in weeks that we would have done that. Hint, hint, hint. Sit on him. Yeah. What other fighting game can you play a fat-ass sumo who just sits on your fucking ass like a pancake and squishes you like grapes? Right? That's what I like about Street Fighter. <laughs> the uniqueness of it. Look at that. Jesus. Time to sit on him. Woohoo! Oh my god. <clears throat> Very nice. Got someone new in the lobby. Good. I think that was a character from Dragon Quest X, was their avatar. Or Dragon Quest XI, excuse me. Trying to say, who did I pick? I did not pick Guile yet tonight. Let's pick Guile. Hong Kong! Reversal wake up super. Very nice. Jason's Soul Calibur is his third favorite franchise. Soul Calibur is pretty good. I used to like Soul Calibur back in the day, but I, don't, I haven't really ever played it competitively. So I was never good enough to really hang or judge it by any kind of competitive merits, you know. Thanks for the random hurricane. I love to flash kick right through that. Appreciate that. <laughs> buffalo burgers? Who's talking about buffalo burgers? Yo, buffalo burgers are fucking seriously good. They're very lean meat, low fat content. They have this unique flavor to them. And I used to get buffalo burgers with hot sauce. Oh my god, that shit's mad good. I'm gonna try a Balrog again. Oh, Balrog and Zangief. Now this is a really hard matchup. Zangief destroys Balrog in this game. What do I do? Yup. They said, Phil, you know, we contribute to you. Whoa. But it always seems like oh it's a black my hole. god. It always seems like oh, no matter how much so we contribute, done. you're always still having problems. You're always still in debt and, and nothing's getting better. I agree with you. Wow, my move dropped. I beat him. My move dropped. I did dash punch, did nothing. Ugh. This is such a hard fight for fucking Balrog. 
Yup, nice trip. Wrong button. Yes. Oh, beautiful reversal! Oh, he fucked up. I think he went for 360 there, and he didn't get it, which is why he got to jump back instead. That would have been a perfect 360 for him, too. I missed, and now I'm fucked. Got him. That was close. If he got any 360s there, I probably would have lost. He was probably going for him, too, and it wouldn't give it to him. Whew. Who has the best burgers? That's subjective. Eternal Day Palm. Like, you gotta compare fast food burgers with more restaurant quality burgers. Like, dude, you know, you can't even do that, really. I actually get to play against Heisenberg. It's working now. Holy shit. Who did not use so far tonight? I did not use. I didn't use Balrog Vega. I'll go with Balrog. Simple Bubble, yeah, we can get into a lobby together. I'd be more than happy to play you, man. Damn. Locked down. Jeez. Jose, oh, I did hear that there's a Cuphead series coming out. I didn't know it was going to be on Netflix, but I was aware of that. Okay. Again with this. <laughs> Again with this. Blanca, Zangief, or Balrog? Who do I want to use? I'll pick Geef this time. Have some Thank salt. Against you. Oh boy. Round one. Fight. Oh Jesus. Look at that range! Look at the fucking 360 range! That was like half screen. That was like a half screen 360. <laughs> wow! Round two, fight! I missed? How the fuck did I miss? Uh-oh. Oh, the endless combos. Endless combo. <laughs> you can't escape. Wow. Damn. That was a comeback spankaroonie right there. He got dominated at the end. Iced coffee. What's up, OIC? He says, hey, Phil, how you doing? I'm doing good. Having fun with Street Fighter tonight. <clears throat> Very nice. You want a Zangief? He wants a Zangief mirror match. When you look in the mirror, what do you see? A big hairy fucking Russian. All right, he picked Honda to counter pick. What a dick face. Oh my God, the lag! Oh my God! Come on! How am I supposed to fucking play this? Ah! I can't even move! Ah! Oh, it hurt! Come on! <laughs> Come on, the leg! Oh my God, what is going on? on? Jesus! I seriously... <laughs> Can I stop joking today? Oh my god. Ugh! Ugh! What the f- <laughs> Fuck! Ugh! 
fuck. Hold up. Shit. It's gonna clear up, I swear. <clears throat> Jesus Christ. <clears throat> okay, it's actually starting to feel better now. <clears throat> Take that shit! Oh my god, yo, the lag is so bad. <laughs> Jeez. Haseo X says your opponents are using Call of Duty lag. It lets them see your moves. Yes. Oh, again? Oh, come on. It's doing it again. It's fucking doing it again. Miserable. Just miserable. Gray is saying they tried to send over a donation. Did you? Did you, Was it a tip or was it a super chat? How was it, Gray? What kind of a, 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 a contribution was it? Because nothing is coming through on my end right now. Wait, if it was a tip, are you sure it went through? Did the button gray out when you clicked on it? Because sometimes there's a glitch with stream elements when you go to send a tip. It'll, it'll glitch out and do a gray out the box so it won't go through. That's happened before. Round one, fight. Oh, shit. I need th that money. I really do. Oh, I need that money to pay my bills. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Ten scalp in my tummy. Yes. Very nice. Time to eat. Oh, I don't want the bunk of all I wanted to eat. Oh, shit. Right on my ass. No, no, no. Oh, that's very bad. Come on. That was terrible. I can't believe that just worked. <clears throat> that sucked. I didn't do that. Oh my god. Oh, here we go. Now he's talking about WWE Champion. He's a piece of shit. You piece of donkey shit. How about this? How about this? Yes, full WWE screen drop pick of legend. I right. love it. Of legend. WWE Champions lives rent free in Nicely your done. motherfucking head. Well, it's the same guy over I and over. Don't I'll play think one more about time. WWE and then, uh, then we'll probably call it you a night do. lobby. We'll, you probably we'll know way different. more about the fucking game than I ever will because you're an idiot. Oh. You're an obsessed. Loser. Yeah, this is the last tip that came through was 14 minutes ago. There's been no other contributions tip-wise We're then, soulmates. So. Now he picked Ken again. Round one, fight! Hadouken! Hadouken! What the fuck? Oh. I agree, there were pretty good matches tonight, Pinocchio. Match quality's been decent. Thank you for 67 likes on the stream and climbing. I really appreciate it. This is the guy who I wanted to play before, and it glitched out. Will it work this time? Yes. I get to play this guy now. Cool. Who did I Thanks, use yet? Eric. I did not use I Vega tonight. That. I did not use... I'll use New Saga, who I suck ass with, but I'll pick him anyway. Daniel says he's been playing Horizon uh, Zero Dawn. Better the second time. Hype for Forbidden West. Sounds good. Christmas Reed. 
Fuck. Wow. No! Oh, I'm alive. I can't believe I was alive. Full super, I survived it. Holy shit. Zero health. Oh, I just like you. Tiger, tiger, aro, 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 tiger, aro, aro. Yes. No, you, you, you. Super. Woo. Alright, I'm gonna I'm probably change lobbies in a minute or two here. Ooh. Ooh, excuse me. I do not smoke weed, Gico. No, I do not. I don't smoke at all. I don't like smoking. Fuck it, we'll go with Vega. Still no bison. We didn't hit the tips goal, guys. Two hundred dollars to see bison. We haven't done it yet. Combos, very nice. <laughs> fuck. Flip. Nice. Go, 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 go. Fatty, fat, fuck, fuck. He punched me in the face. <laughs> Is it standing fierce? It stopped my claw. You ever have someone come at you with a giant metal claw and they're about to stab you, so you just take your fist, you fucking punch the claw right into their fucking face? That's what I would do. I would punch right through it. <laughs> yeah, very realistic. Okay. I just didn't... So I picked everyone but Bison tonight. Could we you? I'll go with Fei Long. <laughs> Oh, so you get my fucking flame kick. Woo oh, you fuck face. Oh, double jump. Yes. Yes. Bonk. The fucking fist of fury to the back of the the back of the ass. Oh shit. Yeah, oh, the full combo didn't come out. That's poor shit. Give it to me. Give me the flip. Oh, yes. Here it comes. Ooh. Oh shit. No, don't do that. No, why did he recover and get a throw when I did a fucking move? No, 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 no. Bad, bad, bad. Bullshit. Fuck you. Didn't do that, come on. No flame kick. Super, oh yes. Oh, oh no. Oh no! Oh god, it was so close. It was so close. Ew, COX says, don't forget to, to I'm gonna go to a new lobby now. Don't forget to tell Honda don't leave his dirty diapers around for a fucking Leon to find in Resident Evil 4. Ugh. That shit was nasty. Like what's in the fucking dumpster moving around? He opens it up, it's like a big soiled diaper in there, like jumping around. Like, oh, I shot it. <laughs> I shot the diaper. All right, new lobby. I got tired of beating up on those two guys. 
All right, guys, so just so you know, I usually play till around 9.15-ish Pacific time. So we've still got about 45 minutes left on the stream. Thank you for being a great audience. Thank you for chilling with me. Good conversation, good contributions. Again, I really like to play with with Bison tonight. So we hit the tips goal. The Bison hat goes on. It's been and I pretty go slow. On a shadow loo win streak. So let's see what we can do here. All right. Boy RD. I always wonder is Dan uh, part of uh, Chef Boy RD? And he says that all the time. Oh, what was that? Did he do jab medium and it comboed? I didn't know that Dan had a combo like that. If he does, I might use that. Missed completely. For you can. Wow, look at that! I didn't know that either. What he just did. And then standing, standing roundhouse. Yeah, this guy knows some Dan, Dan combos. I think he's doing low jab, low medium, and it combos. And he's doing the the light, the light kick, which is the air, like the hurricane kick in the air. And if it combo, if it hits, you can be standing roundhouse, and it works. Huh. <clears throat> Godolkin, boy RD. Hi, Gabo. Jeez, this game changed so much from Alpha 1 to Alpha 3. You gotta play Alpha 1 and watch Sagat do a, fear, a deep first punch tiger blow like that. It goes doo -doo 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 -doo. like your energy bar goes all the way down. You're like, oh my god. Fucking reversal tiger blow just took like 40% of my health bar. <clears throat> You're welcome, Jay. Thank you for the backstories and thank you for playing Vega. Well, Dan just beat fucking Sagat and got revenge for his dad. <laughs> he got revenge for his fucking dad. Wow. Here you go. That's how it's done. All right. Looks like someone had too much chili at Wendy's. You come full circle. Maybe I'll go with Thalcim again. The only character I didn't pick was Bison. I'm waiting for the hat. What is this? Seafood game? It's like a Kung Fu game, I think. I'm really not 100%. It looks good, though. It looks like a good indie style game. Right. You fucking piece of shit. God damn it, <laughs> man. I love it. Uh. I love it. King George, the typical is the bottom right hand corner of the screen, as you can see. <laughs> no, I never owned a gi. <laughs> King George, I would say the night is going good. The matches have been pretty good. The problem is, of course, the game is broken. We know that, though. Um, but overall, I've had some pretty good matches tonight. I'm looking forward to some more. So it's, I'd say it's been a pretty good night. <clears throat> Dal seems says, by karate like, gear, just like one of the show dos. when I laugh and I go... <laughs> Or, yeah, we'll, we'll see. You know, Halloween's uh, quite right a ways like, away. Ack, 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 I always ack. dress up. No, no nice marathon. Like that at all. I, I would think a real karate gi is pretty expensive, no? Like, I'm sure you get a shit-ass replica one on, like, fucking Amazon for, like, ten bucks. It's a piece of garbage. But if you want a real karate gi, I bet they're very expensive. Aren't they very heavy-duty material? I think they are. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Brian has just tipped me $25. And with that, ladies and gents, it is official. It is official for the first time in three weeks or more, because I actually don't remember the last time. We tonight are going to have the bison hat and some bison madness fun. Finally. Are you a functional retard? Finally. It is bison time. Thank you guys for the support. Thank you, Brian. Tip, I appreciate that very much. And uh, let's do this shit. Yes. Yes! Yes! It's time! <laughs> that is if we play a game with Bison. If we play, you know, Street Fighter 2 or, or, or Street Fighter 2 or Alpha 3, they got Bison. There's no Bison in, in uh, Third Strike, so. Oh no. He let him live! 
This guy let him live. He didn't even kill him. He's trying to show off with parries. Oh, come on. He's trying to fucking show off. Look at this shit. Come on, stop showing off. Finish the fight, you ass. Oh, my God. You know, some of us have a time limit that we can play, you fucking dick. <laughs> come on. Good. He deserves that. He deserves to lose the fucking round. Rosef, yes, I have had uh, bison meat. I've had bison or buffalo burgers before. We were just talking about them earlier tonight. It's very lean meat. It has a unique taste to it. It's actually incredibly tasty and not fatty at all, which is great. I like it with hot sauce. I've had them with hot sauce. They're really good. All right. Haha. <laughs> Dalsum's Elephant says, ready? He said, for me, it was <laughs> Very nice. <clears throat> what, what do I do? Says, I imagine you know what Street Fighter 4 again. That seems okay. The problem is most people dropped it, and I'm sure the people who are still playing it are trying. <laughs> I'm not going to know what the fuck to do against them. I didn't even... I really didn't even seriously play the final version of Street Fighter 4 to even know how to play it. So, All right. Purple Pimp Bison. Finally, I get to fucking use Bison. It's been weeks. What the fuck? He picked Bison too. You're not allowed to pick bison. It's my time. It's my bison time. Uh oh, stompy stompy. <laughs> Ain't I a dick, Tater? All right. Come here. I you know you want to tell me. Nye. 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 Come here. And a And a Come here. Come here. Oh, shit. Now he's doing it. Hey. Hey. Oh. Oh. He threw me. That's not fair. It's not allowed. <laughs> Alright, I guess I'll play for real. Like this. Oh shit, it hit me. I don't know why. Destroy. Okay. Very nice. I had to wait like over three weeks to do that with Bison. You realize that, right? No, not third strike. Oh, fucking third strike. Fucking shit. I don't want to play. Third. I really don't want to play third strike again. Today. But whatever. No EX, huh? Completely destroy. Fighters ready. Engage. Punish! Oh, yes! Oh, yeah! You win. The pure violence that is Ken. Ken Kniff from Connecticut. <laughs> yes. No, a third strike again. I want to play Bison. Bison is not in this game. Stop selecting this fucking game. Plus, your connection stinks. You can't even play you. <clears throat> Come on. Oh. Madara, no. He says, can we, can we have a poll on Monday for what fighting game you'll play Friday? I want to play Street Fighter on Friday. I want to play Classic Street Fighter. No matter how many times people ask me, will I play other games? No, I want to play Classic Street Fighter. This is the purpose of my Friday. Third strike again! Well, I got to fix it. Yeah, I 
I'm getting upset. All this time I wait for Bison, they keep picking the fucking game with no fucking Bison. And then Jose joined the lobby on top of it. How do you like them apples, bitch? I'm sorry, did you want to use your fucking Aegis Reflector on me, huh? Is that what you wanted, huh, huh? <laughs> you wanted to do the Aegis Reflector trap on me, huh? Did you like my parry and throwing you out of your own fucking trap? Did you enjoy that? <laughs> See, that's the kind of shit I can pull off regularly in the arcades, no lie. In the arcades, they go on to do that. They want to get me with the trap. I say, parry, fucking toss them right out of it. But it's so hard to do that shit online. Because the connections are bad and you just can't time it. That I actually got lucky and timed it right oh, and got out of the fucking <laughs> trap. <laughs> That's how you're supposed to do it, by the way. That's exactly what you're supposed to do to get out of it. Good shit. Alright, now hopefully I can pick some fucking bison. Yes, Jeffrey Patek. It was late February 2020 when we were doing a retrospective stream. And that's when we randomly watched that vlog from like... 2009, 2010, when I was wearing the, the beige vest. That's when I went downstairs and found it during that stream. And that's when the vest became a meme here on my streams two years ago. That's correct. So it's almost a two-year-old meme, the vests. <clears throat> oh, man. Nick's N6. Yes, I would say there's been some competition tonight. There has. And I've, there's been a fair amount of players on, on PlayStation. It's just sad that the game doesn't work consistently. And we end up having to wait and shit. Would I pick Bison and Hyper Fighting? I would. I'm terrible with them, but I'll fucking pick them anyway. I don't care. Anything to pick to play with Bison tonight. We've been waiting so fucking long to play with them. Wait, I think you know what? I don't think this lobby works. Because you notice there's no health bars. So this is a glitch lobby. God damn it. I'm waiting there the whole time. That fucking thing ain't working. Ugh. Yeah, Madara's Gods is crazy. That was pre-pandemic. That was right before. Like, that was at the start of the pandemic is when that happened. Yep. Well, this isn't working either. Uh, God damn it. Now we're going to start with the bullshit where no fucking matches will work. Everything, every lobby crashes. Uh. This happens sometimes. Every lobby crashes, and then nothing will start. Okay. Oh my god! Oh! God damn it, man. I just want to play the fucking game. Capcom sucks. Capcom didn't make this. Capcom outsourced this collection to Digital Eclipse. Digital Eclipse what, what fucking do sucks. Do? They have made multiple bad collections in the past. <clears throat> oh, man, yeah. Metal Slug is great, Mark. All the Metal Slugs. Every single fucking Metal Slug is good. Every one of them back in the day on arcades were some outstanding games. So much animation and shit in them. They're really good. Madara's got says, man, we all lost track of time because of this virus. I mean, yeah. Think about it. Think about how... You know, 
you think back two years ago, like, oh my god, that was two years ago, right? Like, everything has been thrown out of whack because of the fucking virus, and now the world really feels different. It does. It feels like, kind of like how pre-9-11 and post-9-11, things care. are a lot different. It kind of feels the same way, like pre-virus and now in the middle of the virus. I don't know if we'll ever get to a fucking post-virus at this rate. <clears throat> Oh, man. <clears throat> I don't even know what you're talking about. Okay. Ready up so I can actually see. Good. Hopefully it works. Speaking of Shang Long. Selecting the secret character right now, so we're putting this elaborate code. There he is. That's Shang Long, he's just wearing a, a yellow wig, it's not really Ken. It's <laughs> a lot of fireballs. Already, who's starting? <laughs> I know, I want to play Bison. I really want to use Bison. I hope I can pick Bison. <laughs> I mean, listen to it. It sounds like he's saying, like, Havulkan or something. He doesn't sound like Hadouken. Like Havolkin, Havolkin. What, what do I do? Goro, the best Mortal Kombat boss? Asked Mark. Man, Goro was was the first ever major what? like boss boss where it didn't feel like you were actually fighting a regular fighter. It felt like you were actually fighting a special character because he played so differently. So, was he the best? I don't know, but he certainly was, like, the, the one that started that trend of fighting game bosses now aren't actual playing, like, playable characters. They're, like, a challenge, you know? <clears throat> well, I'm gonna... Oh, you fucking have got to be fucking shitting me! You fucker! Really? Really? Fucking... <laughs> I, at this rate, I don't even know if I'm going to get another match tonight. It's going so badly. Like, this is just ridiculously out of control at this fucking point. I already played these. See, I already played those fucking guys. Try this one. Grow up. Oh, my God. I don't know, man. This is, uh... Now it's not working for them. Oh my god, it's not working for them either. I'm gonna get a headache. I can't believe... I have to apologize to Brian, who tipped $25 to see Bison. And we've played one match since then, and that was 16 fucking minutes ago. This collection fucking sucks. God damn it, man. It sucks ass. It's so bad. This is fucking bullshit. Come on. Play the game.
You gotta be kidding me. It's still not working. This, you know, this happens every once in a while. I think it's their servers. The fucking servers you're using to play. Look, I can't even ready up. I can't even fucking ready up. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh my god, this collection fucking sucks. <laughs> Why? Why, Digital Eclipse? Why are you guys such fucking hacks? Why do you suck so fucking hard? Oh my god. Oh my god. Why am I toxic? Damn it! Special delivery! <laughs> Special delivery! <laughs> Thank you, Tripe, for $1.69 tip. It ain't gonna work. I knew it. The whole game crashed. It did. The whole game has fucked up. This happens every once in a while. The, the servers fuck up in the middle of the fucking night for no reason, and no one can fucking play anybody. If I cannot get it to work, I'm going to smash it with a hammer. That would be really dumb. Smash my PS5 with a fucking hammer. I won't get another one until the PS6 is out. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> this sucks. I can't... And the bot... This is the bummer. I can't stay late tonight either. On top of this not working, I can't stay late tonight to make up for it. This sucks. Online arcade, of course. No. It's all the same people trying to play each other and can't play each other. It really is. It's the same people all trying to start up a match and it won't start up. That's why I keep saying waiting for match to begin. Oh my god, they got into a match. Okay, I gotta stay here and hope it works. Please let it work. <clears throat> The SAOX is smash your PS5. Buy a PS5 Pro. Oh, oh. <laughs> Sounds like a great idea. Mark says 10 of the 26 games I have on PS5 are SNK games. I hope I own some stock at SNK. <laughs> is, I wonder if SNK is even publicly traded. I'm not aware of that. All right, Guts. I'll see you tomorrow for Skyrim. Sounds good, man. Sounds good to me. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, excuse me. So Johnny Trouble kicked his ass. He got a perfect? Holy fuck, how do you get a perfect like that? Damn. That was an ass whooping, apparently. <clears throat> well, at least in Alpha 3 I could fucking pick Bison, right? At least I could fucking pick him. Jesus. And he's a character I picked. Oh, this is the guy This is the guy who was picking fucking uh, Dan. It was actually good with Dan. with Dan, but Bison's way better. Dan's a joke character in this game, so uh, ain't gonna beat me. Nice move.
Got him. <clears throat> he was good. He's good with Dan. He's fucking good with Dan in Alpha 3. He almost got me. God damn. God damn, he almost beat me. Okay. Oh my fucking feet! Oh, Camilla, Camilla, rip out your heart of this fucking game! <laughs> Fuck, man! Oh my god, I can't believe it doesn't work. I can't believe this game doesn't fucking work. Are you fucking shitting me? Yo, I joined this lobby. It said another guy was running the lobby. He's not even in the fucking lobby. <laughs> He's not even in the lobby. Oh. Ziggy Piggy is here. Oh, but it works when they pick third strike, and I can't pick Bison. God damn it. Oh. Good parry. That was another good parry. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. Point blank elbow to the face. Very nice. Fighters ready. Engage. Yes. Full punish, baby. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Dickhead. Pika Pika took me a dollar fifty. So I was expecting you to scream out Psycho Crusher or something. And now, of course, there's A's in the room to ruin it. Yeah, I don't know. This game is just, it's so bad. And the thing is, some weeks it's great. And then other weeks it's like, it's a completely different experience because the game developers are terrible people. <laughs> you know, I can't believe you would sell a collection like this. In this, in this fucking condition. You have to be a, an irresponsible douchebag to do so. Well, at least I get to pick fucking bison. Rock goddamn fucking time. <clears throat> okay. Round one, fight. What the? I, wow! I've never seen that fucking animation. Oh, I think that I've seen it. I don't think I've ever seen it connect like that. Wow. Nice move. Three fucking moves though, come on. <laughs> <out. laughs> wow. Terrible. <clears throat> Let's say OX is if, if my anger makes me go super sane, he wouldn't be shocked. Yeah, 
right. <laughs> oh my god. It just makes it worse when you know you have to wait that long for a match and then the fucking troll follows you into the goddamn room and you have to leave immediately after because he glitches the lobby. It's just fucking so ridiculous. Such a fucking loser in life to be doing that shit. Oh. Okay. Please let me get a couple more matches, man. Please let me get a couple more matches tonight. Guys, I want to say thank you. You've been a great audience. Thank you to everyone who enjoyed the stream, chilled with me, talked, liked the stream. We had over 75. I think we had over 75 likes on the stream from what I can see. Yeah, 76 likes, which is great. I was going for 100, but 76 ain't bad. I'm not going to complain. Thank you for the support. We yeah, everything. Super chats, tips, everything tonight. Thank you, thank you. I'm sorry I couldn't give you a better quality tonight. The game sucks. Was Poison a Street Fighter 4 or only Street Fighter 5? She originally was in Tekken cross Capcom. Or was it, no, Capcom cross Tekken, right? No, excuse me. Street Fighter cross Tekken. She was originally in Street Fighter cross Tekken as a character. But the game flopped, and I guess they felt it kind of sucked. They put so much work and effort into her development because she was a legit character with all kinds of, like, like zone set up with Fireball and Rekka, Rekka combos. Pretty well-designed character. So then they put her into a later version of Street Fighter 4. One of the final versions of the game they put her into. Um, so was she a part of the original cast of Street Fighter 4? No. Was she in Street Fighter 4? Technically, yes. They added her later on. <clears throat> Alright. We got up to 82 likes. 82 likes tonight. So close to 100, but I don't think we're going to make it. I don't think we're going to make another fucking match at this rate, honestly. The fucking lobby suck. Seriously. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Dalsim's Elephant says Tekken characters in the game. He's talking about Street Fighter Cross Tekken. Are the equivalent of WCW wrestlers going to WWE and getting ruined? Yeah. Not only did they not play anything like their Tekken counterparts, they were literally the worst characters in the game. Like, tell, name one Tekken character that was, like, top tier. <laughs> None. They were, all were terrible. Which sucks, you know. It just means that Capcom didn't know what the fuck they were doing when they made the game. <clears throat> Well, hopefully I can get another few matches in, guys, but I'm doing my best. And again, I apologize to you guys as a viewing audience. I really would like to give you more, but I can't stay late tonight, and the fucking thing doesn't work, you know? It is what it is. Wow, now we're up to 90 likes. Thank you, guys. Thank you. <clears throat> Hello to Par Pars Parzival. Good evening. Uh, personally, how am I doing? I'm doing good, personally. Uh, uh, as regards to tonight's stream, tonight's stream, about the first 90 minutes was great, and then it went to shit in the last 20. The fucking game just won't work. <sighs> Dead air. Wow, he didn't ready up. <laughs> All right, I get to play. I'm not going to complain. I get to fucking play. What am I playing Halo next? Sunday Night Eternal. Sunday Night is uh, the next the next delicious stream of Halo Infinite multiplayer. Full of flavor. Very nice. We hit 100 likes on the stream. Thank you, guys. Like I said, that's kind of my goal. Is to hit 100 likes on every stream moving forward. It really will help the channel for engagement purposes.
Damn! Super right into a throw. He can't even move. Wow. Very nice. Oh, good. I'm getting matches. Of course, the end of the stream, I'm finally getting a string of bison matches. It's about that damn time here. About damn time. Right into the throw. Crossed above. So Bison actually does terribly against T-Hawk. T-Hawk dominates Bison because Bison has no reversal. So as soon as T-Hawk gets above him with tick throwing, you can't actually get out of it. He has like an infinite loop where you just tick throw Bison endlessly. Perfect. Lock the hell down. Very nice. All right, uh, Ice Coffee. Have a good night, man. Thanks a lot. <clears throat> Alpha 3. Which I'm okay with. I'll just fucking pick Bison. <laughs> Bison against Gen. Gen is really good, so I gotta be careful here. Very nice. Oh, wrong button. Got him from behind. Tiger, Tiger. Very, very ooh, so ooh, at least I'm getting ooh, some bison tiger, wins now, man. Ooh, Thank ooh, God. Ooh. Bison wins now at the end of the stream. Favorite Alpha 3 stage. Blah, 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 blah. Favorite Alpha 3 stage. Fuck. Oh, a tough question, man. The thing is, I don't really like the stages of Alpha 3. I just don't. Um. Alpha 1 and 2 had much better stages. They skimped on the background to Alpha 3 to make more room for characters in the memory. Ugh. Yes! Baited! Baited into Super! Very nice. Torpedo over the hands. Damn. Very nice. Okay, man. Okay. All right. I got time for like one or two more matches, guys. Doing my best. Oh. Well, 
third fucking strike, so I can't fucking pick fucking Vice. Fuck. God damn it. Fighting great. Engage. Wow. My, move, my aerial moves will not come out at all. I couldn't get Jump jump Hurricane to come out once. And every time I would have beaten her in the air, it never came out. I got all the moves every time. Go for it. See? When it comes out, I get giant combos. Final round. Go for it. It's been pretty slow. Nothing I can do about that online. It's impossible to avoid. That was a great fairy. Huh? She jabbed. Then she canceled into that. I could hit it. My move didn't have come out at all. I just stood there and took the move for no fucking good reason at all. There was literally no reason for me to get hit, but lag. I was wide open to just hit her. And nothing happened at all, even though I did a move. So, fuck that. All right, guys. That's going to be it for tonight's stream. Again, I apologize. I couldn't give you guys better matches. Well, let me put it this way. Not better matches, but more consistent matches. This was one of those nights where, like, the matches that I played weren't half bad at all. The problem was the game wouldn't cooperate, right? <laughs> Thank you to Parzival for a super chat. You keep up the good work with a long time viewer since your AC Revelations review. Awesome. Thank you, Parzival, for the super chat. Thanks for chilling, and thanks for supporting me tonight. Chocoboco also tipped a dollar for these. I looked up who was the oldest Street Fighter character. It looks like Oro wins by being 140 years old. That is correct. He's supposed to be an ancient hermit who comes down from the mountains to fight. He's also canon supposed to be, like, in case Street don't Fighter canon, care. the most powerful character in all of Street Fighter. That's why he only fights with one arm, because if he uses both, he would kill everyone. Seriously. That's what that the lore is. All right. So, at least... You guys enjoyed yourselves, I think. We had a great conversation. It was a good stream overall. And thank you guys for supporting the stream and all the likes on the stream. Everything. Great. I wish I wish I could have provided you a better experience, but I can't make the game work. All right? Until next time, thank you guys very much. Appreciate that. All right. <clears throat> all right, guys. So here's the deal. That is it for tonight. I'm going to upload all this gameplay as usual to DSP Gaming, right? Um. So thank you for being chill and for supporting the stream tonight. Now... Tomorrow, ladies and gentlemen, it is Skyrim Anniversary Edition on the first stream. I'm excited for that. We're in the midst of many fun things in, in the Skyrim Anniversary Edition, including a fucking bandit that has a weapon that's so overpowered because apparently it's part of the Anniversary Edition content that was just added. And it's so broken, I can't build it. Let's see if I can figure out how to tomorrow, okay? Um, tomorrow night, it is Game Pass night. I need you guys to vote on what Game Pass games you want to see me try out for Game Pass night tomorrow night, okay? The more... Hold on. Oh, excuse me. The more... Uh, the more votes, the better. The polls are currently live right now on the main channel page of DSP Gaming. There's three community polls you can vote on. Please vote, all right? And thank you uh, in advance to anyone who does vote. Whatever games win those polls, we're playing tomorrow night. I don't even know what it's going to be. We'll find out tomorrow, okay? Then on Sunday, there'll be more Skyrim on the mainstream and Halo Infinite on the night stream. What I will do is run a...
probably even know what you're talking about. my hands and knees and say thank you and still be on camera, I would do it. We're soulmates.
to the B-side.
Thank you. 